Something smells good. You making cookies, Mom? Yeah, but you know they're for later. You want to give me a hand over here in the meantime? Help me bake? Sure, I'll help you. Thank you, honey. You excited to be off from school for a week? Yeah, I definitely needed a break. So when are the reeds getting here? They're on their way now. Aunt Sarah just texted me about 15 minutes ago. You excited to see them? Yeah, it'll be fun. We're back! Hi, Angela. Hey, Ange. Hi, girls. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Ange. Are you making cookies? They look so delicious. Yeah, Ange. It smells so good in here. Thank you. I take after my mom. She loves to bake. Oh, you guys know Grandpa's not coming, right? What? He's not? I thought he was coming. No, guys. He can't come. He's not well enough. He's still very sick. But Grandma's still coming. That's good. Yeah, but I'm really worried about Grandpa. He's only been getting worse, not better. Oh yeah, Jess told us about what's going on, Ange. I'm really sorry. Thank you, honey. I really appreciate it. Trust me, we're all worried about his health. What happened? His health has just been declining over the past few years, honey. After all, he is 79 years old. I'll go get that. Can you guys keep an eye on the cookies so that Daisy doesn't get them? Sure, Mom. Oh, hey, Jen. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you, too, Ange. Well, come on in. It's cold out here. Hey, Ryan. Merry Christmas. Hey, Chris. Merry Christmas, man. So, Chris, would you like me to make you some hot chocolate? How about you, Jen? No, thank you, Ange, but I'm sure Chris would love some. Okay, I'll go make it for you right now, honey. Thank you. You girls want some hot chocolate? Sure, Mom. Okay. Yum. Hey, my love. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Genevieve. You girls are looking festive in your Christmas sweaters. I'm loving your leggings, girlfriend. Oh, thank you. I saw them at the mall the other day, and I was like, OMG, I have to get them. They're so cool. Aren't they cool? They have like a super cute holiday pattern. Yeah, they are, Brie. I like them. Me too. And Genevieve, I love your boots. Yeah, they're nice. Thank you. Are over-the-knee boots like your thing? I remember you were wearing them at the basketball game too. They sure are, girlfriend. I love, love, love wearing them in the winter. They're very comfy and stylish, too. Of course, Chris here is embarrassed by my fashion choices. I don't know why. Oh, Mom. Here you go, guys. Thank you. Thank you for the hot chocolate, Mom. Of course, honey. It's my pleasure. And Jen, here's some cookies for you to take home. Thank you, Ange. You're always so thoughtful. Of course. Just thought I'd spread some Christmas cheer. Olivia, Brianna, can I give you some cookies to take home? Aw, thank you. That's so nice. Yeah, thanks. You're very welcome, girls. I'll go put some on a plate for you. Your mom is so nice, Jess. Yeah, I'm like so lucky to have her. Hey, Chris, you want to go shoot some hoops in the driveway? Yeah, let's go. Hey guys, Merry Christmas! Hey Luke. Yo Luke, what you up to? My sister and I are just out taking a walk. You guys know my little sister, Alicia. Yeah, hey Alicia. Merry Christmas. Uh, hi? You don't have to be so shy, Alicia. They're my friends. Aren't you cold, bro? It's 20-something degrees outside and you're wearing shorts. Yeah, I'm fine. I have my hoodie and baseball cap to keep me warm. A baseball cap can't keep you warm. It's not a real hat. Yeah, man. How are you not freezing? I'm just not feeling the cold all that much. Hey, Luke. Come play. Nah, man. Alicia and I have to get home. We're having the fam over for Christmas Eve dinner. That's cool. My cousins are gonna be here in a little bit. You sure you don't want to shoot some hoops with us for a few minutes? Alright. One hoop. He shoots, and he scores! That was fun. Well, it was nice seeing you guys. We've got to get home. Come on, Alicia. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas, bro. Hi, guys. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas, Angela. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Daisy! Hi, Daisy! Hey, guys. You made it. Merry Christmas! 
Merry Christmas, Merry Jess. Merry Christmas, Jess. You guys excited that's Christmas? Yeah. Hey, Liam. Merry Christmas, bro. Merry Christmas, Ryan. I hope you get that new Xbox game. Yeah, man. I've been begging my parents for it since it first came out. Hey guys, Home Alone is on in the family room if you want to come watch. Yeah, I love Home Alone. It's like my favorite Christmas movie of all time, besides Elf. I love Elf. Can we watch it after Home Alone? Yeah, Ellie, or like when we get back from dinner. Hey guys, you guys watching Home Alone? Dad, you're home from work. Uncle Dave! Merry Christmas, Uncle Dave! Hey guys, come give your favorite uncle a hug. Hey, man. Merry Christmas. Yeah, man. So glad you guys were able to drive down for the holidays. Liam, Ellie, Lily, can I get you guys some hot chocolate? Yeah. yeah. Are you going to put marshmallows in it, Aunt Angela? Yes, honey. I did not forget the marshmallows. What's hot chocolate? You know, a chocolate drink that's hot. You're a little young to be having hot chocolate, sweetie. I don't want you to burn yourself. Plus, you're gonna have plenty of sweets tonight. We have cookies and other stuff. And we're even having my personal favorite, banana cream pie. Mmm, sounds good. So hopefully Grandma gets here soon, guys. The Christmas Eve service starts at 5, and it's 3 now. Jess, Ryan, please make sure you're ready by 4.45. I know how long it takes you to get ready, Jess. Yeah, Mom, I'll start getting ready soon. Ellie, Lily, look at all the presents. Yeah, I can't wait to open them. I hope I get my new train set and a Nintendo Switch. I want one so bad. Yeah, and my Barbie dream house. I hope I get Warzone 2.0. It's the number one thing on my Christmas list. Hold on, guys. It's not time yet. When will it be time? Tonight, when we get home from the restaurant. I don't want to wait. I want to open them now. Yeah. You have to be patient, guys. In the meantime, let's watch Christmas movies and drink hot chocolate. Yeah. yeah. Wait, Rai. We've got to get ready for church, remember? Oh, yeah. I already know what I'm going to wear. Me too, Rai. I've, like, got my whole Christmas Eve outfit planned out. There you go, guys. Liam, I made sure to put marshmallows in yours. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. I wonder what Santa's gonna bring us from the North Pole. He better bring us something good. You guys know there's no such thing as... Yes, you can't say things like that in front of your cousins. Oh yeah, right. I'm sorry. There's no such thing as what? Nothing, honey. Just enjoy your hot cocoa. Mom, come on in. Everyone's here. Grandma! Grandma! Hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. Hello, kids. Hi, Mom. So glad you could drive down. Of course, dear. Can't miss Christmas. So how's Grandpa doing? Sorry he couldn't come. Yeah, we miss him. I know, kids. You wanted to see your grandfather for Christmas. But you know he's not well. In fact, I might even have to admit him into the hospital. He's been in a lot of pain lately. <gasps> oh no! That's not good. That is like the last thing we need to hear on Christmas. Don't be surprised, honey. You know his health has slowly been declining for the past few years. Yeah, Mom, I'm like fully aware of that. But let's like try to be positive, okay? It's Christmas Eve. Yeah, guys, look, Home Alone is on. Let's watch. Hey Barbara, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, guys. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, guys. I hope you guys get some good presents. So what are your guys' plans for the rest of the night? We're actually headed to a restaurant for dinner. Waterside Restaurant, I think it's called. It's a really nice place. Good food, right on the water. You get a great view of the bay. It's expensive, but it's a special occasion after all. It's okay to splurge once in a while. Yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful time. We're headed out for dinner too. We're meeting our extended family at the restaurant. That's nice. My sister and her family are here too. They're spending Christmas with us. That's nice. 
Yo, what up, Brian? Merry Christmas! Hey, Sean. Merry Christmas, bro. You doing anything fun to celebrate? My mom is cooking dinner. She's making my favorite, prime rib. Ugh, I love prime rib. You're so lucky, Sean. And I get to have cookies and eggnog afterwards. Ew, I hate eggnog. It's so gross. My dad loves it. I don't know why. You don't like eggnog? Bro, you're so lame. It's the most delicious darn thing in the entire world. Come on, guys. We don't want to be late for our reservation. Yes. I'm starving. Wait, Jess. Are you wearing my necklace? Yeah, I borrowed it. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. It looks good on you. Just please make sure to ask me first before wearing my jewelry going forward. Okay, honey? Okay, Mom. Let's go eat! Yeah! yeah. Hello. We have a reservation. Table for ten? Are you under Baldwin? Yes, that's us. Okay, you can follow me. We've got your table ready for you. This is a nice restaurant. Yeah, Elle, it is a nice restaurant. Why are there trees inside? I don't know, Lily. They're probably there for decoration. I mean, this is a nice restaurant. Do they have spaghetti here? I'm sure they do, Liam. They've got everything here you could possibly want. Let's look at the menu when we sit down. So yeah, my kids are all excited for winter break. Ryan especially. He does not like going to school at all. You know, he's in middle school now. He's going through a lot. He hates math especially. Math is definitely not his strong suit. Now, his math teacher is wonderful. Just had her too. She's so sweet. Very, very sweet. You can tell she cares very much about Ryan and just wants what's best for him. But she can be a bit strict. Ryan does not like her. He always complains about her. She's also just his cheer coach, and with her being so strict, it kind of takes the fun out of cheerleading for her and her friends. Yeah, that's unfortunate. My kids don't like school either. Ellie has trouble with math too, and taking Lily to preschool is a nightmare especially. You know she's always clinging to my side, crying when I drop her off. Her teacher always has to come help me get her situated. Her teacher even told me that she won't play with the other kids in her class, because all she thinks about while at school is me. That she's always crying for me, asking when I'm coming back. It's terrible, Angela. Trust me, I want nothing more than to help my poor daughter with her separation anxiety. I'm really hoping she outgrows it soon, because I'm not going to be around forever, you know? I know exactly how you feel, Sarah. Jess had really bad separation anxiety at the same age. Always attached to me at the hip, wouldn't let me go anywhere without her. She would cry when I dropped her off at school or whatever. She just felt very insecure if I wasn't by her side all the time. That all changed when she met Olivia, her best friend. You've probably met her before. She's the short one with the blonde wavy hair. Very cute, sweet girl. She and Jess do everything together. You should know she's also a dancer. Anyway, they were in the same preschool class, plus they also took ballet together. And Jess really took a liking to her. The two of them really bonded. Having her best friend there definitely helped to put her at ease when going to school. Now, at 13 years old, she's always with her friends. She's out with her friends more than she's home, actually. She's definitely not attached to me anymore. Yeah, she used to be so shy when she was little, and now she's a social butterfly. That's so wonderful. I'm so happy for her. Hopefully that'll be the case with Lily, too. That would be wonderful. Yeah, Sarah, it would be. This is really good salmon. How's your food, guys? It's good. Yeah, I love the spaghetti. How's yours, Ryan? It's so good. This place has the best pasta dishes. So, you guys excited to have a week off from school? Yeah! Yeah! I'm, like, really excited. I have all of this time to, like, just hang out with my friends. It's too bad my friend Maddie is away on vacation. She's not going to be back until, like, the end of winter break. And I miss her so much. Where did she go? She's in Europe with her family. Paris, I think. I'm literally so jealous of her, Ellie. I've, like, always wanted to go to Europe. Like, why didn't she take me with her? I have no idea. 
couple of my friends are away on vacay too. Matt is out of state visiting his family, I think. And Caden is in the Bahamas. Do you miss your friends, Ryan? Yeah, but I'll see them when I go back to school. Also, my best friend Chris is here, I'm thankful for that. Plus my buddies Luke and Sean. I miss my friends, they're all away. Yeah, mine too. Come look at this view, guys. Water. Yeah, Lily, water. Look at how pretty the water is. I like the water, it's calming. Yeah, bro, it sure is. I want to go swimming in the water. No, Lily, we can't go swimming in that water. It's probably cold, like you'd freeze to death if you swam in it. And we don't have our bathing suits on. Yeah, Lil, you don't want to get your clothes wet. Come on, guys, let's go. You guys have presents waiting to be opened. Let's go, guys. It's cold out here. Brr. All right, we've all got our Christmas pajamas on. It's time to open presents. Yeah! yeah. Can't wait. Okay, who wants to open the first present? Me! Me! I do! Jess, you go first. All right, I'll open this one first. What'd you get, Jess? I got Victoria's Secret Scandalous. That's for me. I know how much you love Victoria's Secret, Jess. Yeah, it's like my favorite line of products. Thank you, Mom. You're welcome, honey. Ryan, you're up next. All right, I choose this one. I think I know what this is. No way! You guys got me Warzone 2.0? Oh my gosh! We know how badly you've been wanting that game, Ryan. I stopped at Best Buy to get it for you. Thanks, guys. I'm so excited. I'm gonna have so much fun with this. Liam, you go next, honey. Okay. Yes! Monopoly Star Wars! This game is so fun! Yeah, Liam. People have said great things about it. Up next is Ellie. Yay, the Barbie dream house! All right! I hope you like it, sweetie. I love it! Thanks, Mom! Thanks, Dad! Let's let Lily open a present now. Yeah, Lily, open this one. What is it? Book! A book! Yeah, honey, it's The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carl. I thought this would be a great opportunity to introduce you to reading. Oh my gosh, you got her The Very Hungry Caterpillar? This was like my favorite book when I was a kid. Mine too. Lily, you're gonna love the story. It's a good starter book. Caterpillar. All right, new Jordans. These are so cool. Yes, Lego City. Thank you. Ooh, look, Lily. You got Little Critter, as well as the Paw Patrol to the Rescue play set. Look, Mommy, it's Chase. Yeah, honey, that's Chase on the box. Well, I guess that's it on the presents. This really was a great Christmas, guys. Thank you. Hold up. We've got one more present for Liam to open. Yes, what is it? Here you go, son. Thank you. I'm gonna open this right now. Where'd you get, Liam? A Nintendo Switch! Yeah! I've been wanting one! And look, I got you a couple games for it. Super Mario Odyssey and Lego DC Super Villains. Thought you might like those. Thanks, Dad. I love them. And I love my new train set, too. I love all of my presents. Yeah, me too. And I think Lily loves all of her presents, too. Do you like your presents, Lily? You got some good stuff. Yeah. My favorite present was definitely Warzone 2.0. Can't wait to play. We know, Ryan. You've literally been talking about it all month long. And I also got some cool new sneakers. I got some new shoes, too. I got a pair of Vans. I love them. Thank you. Dessert is served. Come into the dining room, everyone. Dessert, yay! Hey, Liam, after dessert, let's go downstairs and play Warzone 2.0. Yeah. I love the sugar cookies, Mom. They're so good. The frosting is like my favorite part. My favorite are the chocolate chip cookies. You definitely take after Grandma, Mom. Thank you, honey. Now, I taught your mother a thing or two about baking, didn't I? Yeah, definitely. Ellie, what are you doing? You've already had enough sweets for tonight. Please, Mommy? No, no more. You're gonna get sick. But Jess and Ryan get to have more. 
Your cousins are older, honey. That's different. Now come on, Lily. It's time for bed. <laughs> Honey, but it's Christmas Day tomorrow. Don't you want to get a good night's sleep? Now come on, it's bedtime. Ryan, are we gonna go play your game? Yeah, Liam, let's go.